the heck is that? Is that a footprint? No, there's no way. Wait a minute. There is something incredibly big, incredibly scary happening here. Did you hear that? Well, I'm not waiting if you heard that. What is going on here? Oh my God, wait. Thank goodness there is somebody I recognize, a loyal supporter of Kosai. Beth, what's going on here? What is going on? I don't know, I'm seeing changes. Rawr! <laughs> is that a good enough hint? Um, it sounds like we have some very quiet, very small animals here. Is that what, can I hear it again? Dinosaur. What do you think this is gonna do for Kosai in the long run? Well, you know, my heart's always been here for Kosai, being the number one science museum in the country, I think it's just gonna blow us up even higher. Rawr! Rawr! <laughs> there you go. The world's coming to Columbus. We can't imagine that anybody would ever leave Columbus. 65 million years of history is a big deal. And we at the Columbus Foundation, as you might know, love big deals. What is going on in this building? Well, it's all about dinosaurs, baby. I'm excited. Uh-oh. Say a little more dinosaurs. You got a roar for me? Okay. Uh, baby T-Rex. What do you think this can do for the city of Columbus? Well, I think the collaboration we have with the American History, Natural History Museum is one that just it, it exemplifies the Columbus way. We work together to bring big stuff to the city because we are a big, great city. Ah! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it here. President of City Council, Zach Lang. So the Triceratops is my favorite dinosaur. And it's my favorite dinosaur because it just eats vegetation. I, I like the dinosaur that flies. I mean, you know, that's, that's the one I like. Roar! Come on. The American Museum of Natural History is so, so important for the city of Columbus. One, it's important for our families and our children, and so we just bring us all together. But also, it's so exciting for our tourists. We now will have this world-class exhibit, this world-class partnership in Columbus, Ohio. How great is that? Did you say four generations here at COSA? Four generations have been coming to COSA, yes. <laughs> Dinosaurs. Let's hear it. Roar! <laughs> for COSI to work with the American Museum of Natural History, really one of the leading museums in the world, is very impressive. I think it brings some of the talent that AMH has, not just in New York, from around the world, and COSI here in Columbus together to share not just some great artifacts, but some great learning, some great education, and some great programming that will only benefit the citizens of Columbus for, again, years to come. Curtis, Curtis Jewell, good to see My you. Man. I know you know something. You said you've been a veteran on the board for 30 years. What's going on here at COSA? Dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> the last word, I mean roar, is gonna be yours. Roar! Come to COSA. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it here from our friends, from our supporters from public officials that this is indeed an exciting time here at COSI. Yes, we are bringing dinosaurs right here to the Midwest. But even greater than that is this rich partnership we have with the American Museum of Natural History. This is the number one natural history museum in the world, partnering with one of the greatest science centers right here in the United States to bring you programming like you've never seen before. So make sure you come here to COSI, enjoy this dinosaur exhibit, and enjoy the fantastic collaboration we're doing with a great natural history museum. Oh, Frederick, you want actually me to try to mimic the sound of a dinosaur. Okay, here we go.